We should start a new weekly series where we just talk about anime and manga and how much we love it and know about it because we know more about it than everybody else. I do not enjoy that topic at all. <laughs> that stance of a new... <laughs> Ooh, guck. <laughs> what? I'm looking at, I was seeing if there's anything better than with truck, and just guck is in bold. Oh. I don't know what it means. Guck, you can, like, you know, like, this is gucky. Okay, okay. Got some guck on me. Ugh. A slimy, dirty, or otherwise unpleasant And I'm substance. Bad Tracy. He got mud and cow guck all over his white jersey. Hey guys, Lex Style here. That could work because he's like a, he could get a, like a, a wife beater on. Yeah, okay, White so beer. we're starting a video now. This is the giveaway for 70-something. <laughs> 72? I don't remember. Three for Peter. Maybe we can look. Yeah. 72. It's the giveaway for 72. Uh, we're real good at this. We, yeah, we are. I want to show something before we do the giveaway. Well, I wanted to say, as we talk here, Okay. because I have a thing to talk about, too. We're not reading the names out anymore, oh, yeah. so we're going to have them be scrolling. Stop. We're gonna be having them scroll on the screen. Um, yeah, my uh, the, the rules are: if you win, you win. We draw your name, put it in a hat. We draw your name, and then you win. And then you have like a week or what do you have? A week. You get two, two giveaways two, to pick up your two code. giveaways to pick up the code. You message him on Instagram at BrayTracy01 or email us at WouldYouSpendDavidTimelon at gmail dot com. That's our real email. Uh, you wanted me to bring this up. Yes. Um, in a real video that we knew more people would watch. Yeah. Jason Getz, you still have a Star Wars A New Hope to pick up, and have facts, you have Star Wars The Empire Strikes Back to And I'm just going to check the email real quick to make sure that they just haven't gotten, because, like, I checked. Okay. They did, they, the last time we checked, they hadn't had it. No, I'm not interested uh, in their yeah, films anymore. They still haven't, uh, they still haven't done anything. They only so. released one really good one I liked. Um, that was Assholes. It's a really good movie. Go check it out. Directed by Peter Vack or something like that. Bat wanted me to show this next thing yeah. off. Um, mainly for Nicole Jones. Oh yeah, uh, Nicole, check this out. She, she watches these, right? I'm sure yeah. she's entered. Uh, so, this was in Tuesday Blues Day. We just didn't know if how many people actually do watch those. That um, so We don't know the crossover. Yeah, we don't know the crossover. Well, we know the crossover because we can look at the right views. We just yeah. don't know who because not as many people comment, I think, on Tuesday yeah. Blues Day. Um, so I got a advent calendar you know where you open a door every day yeah. at christmas but it's a funko pop oh wrong side but it's a funko pop marvel advent calendar so it's got little figures of all the guys and their little outfits and everything i can name spider-man winter soldier i think this is baron zemo this is Sunspot. It's an X-Men character. This is Squirrel Girl. And I want to say this is... Vision. His picture's think, right yeah. there. His yeah, picture's right Vision. there. I'm more of a DC guy. <laughs> um, so that'll be cool. We're going to do a video every single day of December for me up with Unboxing. Are you? No. I was no. thinking about doing a 31 Maybe Days like a of week. Christmas. I would love Where that. Like, I just upload a... 31 Days? You mean 25 Days? Sure. I was just going to do, like, where I watch a Christmas movie and then do a review of it. I love Christmas. Almost all of our decorations are already up. Yeah. I love Christmas. I've been listening to Christmas music already. Let's get into it, though. Yeah, okay. My feet are freezing. Oh, real quick. I just watched Christmas Break-In on Netflix. He just did that. How was it? Three stars. Guess how much Ross's drum set is. $8,000. Close. He said if he had a guess on the total amount of how much he's put into the drum set, it would be $5,000. That's insane. He said that his one cymbal alone is $500. He's never hit a cymbal. He's never struck a cymbal better than that. He said that if he ever bought, had to replace a, his ride cymbal, it has to be that same brand and probably the same one. Hmm. Yeah. Also, when Bella does that, I know it comes up on camera. <laughs> and it sounds so oh, weird. I didn't think we were editing. leaving that in because it's raw stuff. So First up... I don't want to go grab it. It's the stupid shell case. Um, You're welcome. Um, okay, uh, so first up is Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles 2 Out of the Shadows. Put those in your These room. These are historical documents. Put them in your room. They're going on top of the... No. Record. 
going in my box. I'm fucking done the intro for this one goddamn movie. Um, Jester, this and the next two movies are all maybe, or they are expired. <laughs> yeah. Here's the official hat, people. And... Here's a brilliant hunter. Start. start. seconds yeah, okay let's uh yeah s over you got double entries because you were the only person to enter for the four catwomans well you weren't the only person to enter, but you got it right um it, the answer was in theatrical order 1966 batman the movie was lee merriweather then um michelle pfeiffer in batman returns then halle berry in catwoman the movie and then at Anne Hathaway in uh, Anne Hathaway. The Dark Knight Returns. Everyone please at, The Dark Knight Rises. Sorry. Everyone please at Anne Hathaway to get her to watch our videos. I was born in a small town. I was born in that small town. And I was born in a small town. Yeah, I was born in that small town. You know how much I hate that song. The winner of TMNT 2 is Homer Thax. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I think first whoa. time. First time, because I didn't know... Next up, also could be expired, it's, we have to grab them. It's right here. Oh. It's Dunkirk. Hey. You jerk. Huh. <laughs> I made a rhyme. Cool. All right, so 30 seconds for Dunkirk. Starts now. Okay, let's draw someone for Dunkirk. Yeah, I know, Bella. It was exciting. That's a conversation they'll never know about. Unless they slow it down. And the winner of Dunkirk, P. Morelli. P. P. Morelli. Nice. It's over there, so you don't have to grab, grab it. it. It might also be expired. It's Percy Jackson 2. Sea of Monsters. Sea of I think Monsters. is what it's called. Yeah. I should watch the first one again because I love that movie. Yeah, I'm going to watch both of them again, because I don't think it'll second. Up. You've never seen the second, though, right? No. 30 seconds on the clock, starting new. Oh, you should grab it first. Starting new. Or cope. Do we figure out a cope? And the winner of Percy Jackson 2 is Herman Distelkamp. Oh. Next up is for Boy Bory 4. Give it a Let's get Boy Bory 4. Boy Bory 4. Bora Bora. Boy Bora. Boy Bory 4. Their little gingerbread men. Would be about Randy Orton. This is Toy Story 4. What's your favorite movie with Randy Orton? I don't know what name the couple. Too much glass. Too much glass. Too much glass. Three. Even more glass. Too much more glass. Four. Forber glass. Too much glass. Five. The thrive for glass. Too much for six. He caught his dick in some six. In some glass. Uh, two much for seven. Glass. Habit. No. It is too much glass. Six. Pick up glass. <laughs> oh. <laughs> too much six, er, too much glass seven glasses in heaven made from it comes from heaven too much glass eight we made him eight too much glass nine this is us that one. is that one this is who i am i don't know anyway i've uh, uh i've seen one of them with him no i've never seen one of his movies i don't know 12 rounds reloaded uh this is for toy story 4 we just talked about glass for a while <laughs> started now that context or how it just one of them was about fire <laughs> i'm gonna reach in and draw a name cool. <gasps> burnsy, burnsy! 
That's perfect, because I sort of said the fire then. Oh, yeah, and you <laughs> went to Burning Man. Yeah. Oh, my God, Burning Man. Burns you a Burning Man. Yeah, we made this joke. Did we? Yeah. Burns you, man, we called it. Oh, yeah. is that on camera? Is yeah, it was on camera. Okay. Uh, <laughs> so, Burns you got Toy Story 4. Woohoo. Rolling, rolling, rolling through the gates of rolling. 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 What's next? That's such a good song. Uh, next is. <sighs> Fuck. I'm not upset that it's next. I'm upset because I remembered it existed. We saw this in theaters. I know. Don't remind me. It was such a bad experience. Yeah. I just I hated it. I just saw this is the line. Thing. I just saw some movie yesterday, like the trailer for it, or just an actor, like on a talk show. I was like, oh yeah, I was in that. I was like, I saw that in theaters, and I shouldn't have. Given I money. work. It wasn't this it with was a s a very strict Lion King apologist. He loves this unabashedly. He thinks it's better than the cartoon, and because he's like, dude, it takes everything you love about the cartoon and builds on it and adds to it, and it's better and funnier and. Like, dude, no, it sucks. Who is that? Yeah, I just saw someone, like an actor, was like, oh, and then you were in this. And he's like, yeah, I was. And I was like, I gave that money. It wasn't like You made a billion dollars. Yeah. Well, uh, enough. At least everyone knows it's bad. Uh, Not everybody does. Most know it. Elton John knows it's bad, and that's what's important. Yeah. Started now. Say that until after the. Dun, dun, dun. And the winner of the Lion King, not the good one, is Ben Lord. <laughs> you know what these are called? Jumping jacks? Yeah. Do you know what these are called? Standing jacks? Jacks. Uh, <laughs> I thought this was going to be a segue no. to the movie. Maybe his character <laughs> name is Jack? No. I feel like Next up. Old. Okay. Is it's a wonderful life. Hey. We don't have any available for to grab. Yeah. Oh, I mean we have the this one. It's a wonderful life, <laughs> but it's the 4K code. Yeah. It's a good movie. Um, we're gonna watch it Christmas time. No, we are we watching. What do we have to watch now? Miracle on 34th Street. <sighs> See, it's interesting. It's past my year deadline. <laughs> it's no, what's your deadline? Um, 54, I think. Then that's from 64. Amazon. When did the movie suddenly get released? 1954. The film Suddenly, the movie, was released about 65 years ago on September 17th, 1954. Okay. I really wish it would have been like 2013. I'm like, not the remake! <laughs> With, you know who's in the remake? Ray Liotta. Oh, yeah. I like it. I don't like it. Shake this. Start. It's a life. It really is. It's a banger. Yep. The winner of It's a Life, Ray Sai, or Tsai, or Tsai. Probably Sai. Hey, congratulations, Ray Sai. <laughs> Pony Pony Ravioli was uh, uh, one character name I had in Extreme Warfare Revenge. Like, it was one of my booker names. So. Uh, why? I just thought it was a funny name. The Pony is his nickname, though. His, like, so his, his birth name is Tony Ravioli. <laughs> his nickname is Pony. So it's Tony Pony Ravioli. Uh, hey, so next up, in contrast to what your favorite old movie of all time, It's Wonderful Life, it's your least favorite old movie of all oh, time. Yeah, God. The Wizard of Oz is up next. I should have mentioned this in the collection update. I like Oz the Green Powerful, yeah. directed by Sam Raimi. Way more than like this <laughs> shitty ass movie. It's not good. Uh, Burnsy also said yeah. he hates it, and then he said in a second comment, uh, "It's boring and it has a weird plot." Yeah, and someone quoted Waterboy. Let's get to it. Start. Start. Plays the monkey. Yeah. I also really don't like the Tin Man. 
Yeah, you said that already. Yeah, but it wasn't on camera. Well, it kind of was, technically. Yeah, technically, but... And the winner of the Wizard of Oz is JW, which stands for wizard. JW, you are wizard Just of wizarding. Oz. Just wizarding. Next up, oh, they're in the DC section. None of our movies are available to us. Yeah, okay. Teen Titans, go! go versus to the movie, Teen Titans. James. To the movies. Teen Titans, go! Or T T N T E E N T I T A N S. Teen Titans, let's go! T E E N T I T A N S. It's hard to spell. It really is hard. They do such a go! To the movies. Alright, so this is for Teen Titans, go versus Teen Titans. It should just be Teen Titans versus Teen Titans Go. Yeah. It sounds so much easier. <clears throat> Teen Titans Go versus Teen Titans does not roll off the tongue. It could even just be Teen Titans versus Go. No, that sounds stupid. Okay. Teen Titans versus Teen Titans Go, to me, is a better title. Teen right. Titans Go! No, 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 no. I guess right, I'm doing you're this You're doing one. this one. Okay. I'll round out with one. Okay. One. Start. Oh, wait. I'm shaking them. Told Have you, you fucking about Scoob? seen Scoob? I said the other day, I was like, did you see the stuff for Scoob? Because we were talking about Hanna-Barbera, then I went into work and this guy made a hilarious Hanna-Barbera joke because we were having credit card yeah. processing issues, and the guy said, he's like, yeah, you know, because like, uh, co-worker is like, oh, technology, sometimes you'll love it, sometimes you'll hate it. And he's like, yeah, I know how, what you mean. I mean, you know, it runs like the Flintstones sometimes, and you just want it to be the Jetsons. I was like, that is hilarious, fellow man. I talked to it was right when I got to work, so I was like, Have 15. you seen the voice cast? Yes, I've known about the voice cast for months. I just don't like how Fred looks. Everyone looks good. <gasps> no? No. I can tell you a million lies, but in the land of a million drums, there is always something going on. No, no. I swear I saw this one. And the winner of Teen Titans versus Teen Titans Go, because we're changing it. Yeah, we are. The are. Dark Knight, Jimmy! <laughs> Congratulations. You're not in this movie, Jimmy. You're not in it. And your time was incredibly cut in the first one, for some reason. Still... Oh, yeah, Jimmy Kimmel voices Batman. What if this is Jimmy the, Kimmel? Do you remember the good joke in the trailer where he's like, It's Batman. Batman, Batman, Batman returns. returns. Batman, Batman forever. Batman. Batman Returns! Batman Forever! I think it's because Jimmy Kimmel was so upset that no one got to see all of his dialogue that he's like, you know what, I'm gonna be the Dark Knight Jimmy, it's who I am. And I like these guys. Oh, it could, it is Jimmy Kimmel. Did Dad show you the Jimmy Kimmel clip that he freaked out about? Yeah. Jesus Christ. Last up is for Wonder Woman Bloodlines, which is great. It was a good movie. Really good. Yeah. Bella, stop barking. Bella, we're almost done. So it's bloodline start. No, because they always talk about it in movies. Oh. Really, because they always bring it up mostly in aliens. When the one guy's like sitting down, and he's smoking a cigarette, and they're like, "Yes, you're on a hostile alien planet, but you got oh no, you got time to go smoke or punch a dart." <laughs> and then like, there's a part in uh, Prometheus where a guy like sneaks off to hide behind some rocks to go smoke a cigarette, and they're like, "You're on a fucking planet where nothing's going on and nobody cares or gives a shit about what's happening, but oh, you gotta go hide while you punch darts." <laughs> Sorry. S over you got the Wonder Woman <laughs> bloodlines. I don't even think we announced right. the movie. Just been confirming you're in this. <laughs> you're not you're not entered. Okay. Deadpool Wars! You got Wonder Woman Bloodlines. <laughs> Thanks for watching. That was a thing that we did. It was It's fun. I had fun. Yeah. This was a fun one. We're yeah. trying to be really quick, so sorry if it seems rushed. Uh, like this video, give it a thumbs up, it helps a lot. Yeah. A lot, and then subscribe for more videos, of course, and hit the notification bell, so you always know when we're uploading. Yeah. Let's do a trivia thing, if so if people watch this far. 
Okay. Um, in quotes, say Wolverine's one line in X Men First Class. I don't know that. Oh, it's where they walk up and he just goes, "Go fuck yourselves." Oh. I'm a father son duo who have both been shot and killed on Ooh. during filming. Like a specific one, or does it happen more than once? Because I know one. <laughs> I know one. Dude. Okay. <laughs> Name the father son duo that both died. From a gunshot, from a wound, gunshot wound while filming a movie. While filming a movie. Anyway, I'm Bad Tracy. You can follow me on Instagram, Twitter, and start us at Bad Tracy01. I've been Lex Dahl. You can follow me on Instagram at Straight or JTS Turk and on Twitter at ADD Dahl. Uh, you can go check us out um, on YouTube, Twitter, and Instagram at Punk Rock Blues. And you can pledge to our Patreon at patreon.com slash punk rock blues. Do that. I destroyed this cup. Burnsy, we'll see you in the credits. We will. Baby. Also, you want a movie today. That's pretty cool. Why did you say you'll see him on a movie today? What? I said I'll see him in the credits. Oh, no, but then after you, I'll see you in a movie today. No, you want a movie. Oh, okay. You should not pay attention. <laughs> Boom! Ooh, awesome. That was really cool, wasn't it? It bounced over there and flew into her bed right in front of her nose. Wow. That was awesome.